Okay, this is an absolute gem of an archive video that I have for you guys today and for myself to go back and look at. So let's go have some fun. So when I get bored here on our Southern Illinois farm, I dig through a lot of the old tens of thousands of videos and folders and projects and so forth. I didn't feel like going deer hunting this afternoon. It's a nice day. But I did dig through some old files and I found some never before seen footage of the very first time I got a tractor stuck. My very first tractor and the very first time I got it stuck. This is all brand new video except for like the first clip which was like my first hole digging video with my uh, I had a 37 horse open station John Deere back then. This was literally about a decade ago. It was uh, early, like March 2012. Anyways, just fun to look back and see kind of our humble beginnings between me and Sharon when we got together. So let's check it out, have some fun, and hope to see you on the next video. Thanks a lot. Okay, so this first clip, this is like the first hole I ever dug with my tractor. Honestly, I think if you go to our channel, I, I think this is either the very, very first video ever or literally one of the first videos. So we bought a uh, property rehab, 36 acres in Wisconsin. It was our first acreage together. And yes, it was a fixer upper. So what I was doing here was I was digging a hole out in the back field because the previous owners had a big fire pit that they burned you know every single weekend and there was a lot of trash back there so I was just gonna bury all this burned up leftovers from this fire pit so that's why I was digging this hole to fill it with all this debris let's see how that kinda went So here in the background you could see this whole entire hill is sand. It's actually a sand pit. The, uh, the city and the county uh, used to use this pit to get sand for highway projects and stuff. But it also made a fantastic and private bonfire spot on the weekends which is why they used it and I don't blame them. Beautiful spot for a bonfire to get away from people in the city and stuff here in a uh, I mean, it's not sparsely populated, but it's a lot more populated than the country, but it's not quite city either. So this is where I got stuck the first time ever on my very first tractor, but so many fond memories. I mean, this is why ever since my kids were little, I've always taken videos. I took pictures and videos just because it's just such a gem and a treat to look back so many years. I mean, geez, I can't, if I went back past 10 years, you guys would think I was like, you know, 12 or 14 years old the way I look compared to now. But anyways, let's see how I got out of this mess. Keep in mind, I never had any operating experience. 
I had only operated a, a front end loader at a junkyard yeah, a few times like you know a decade or two decades before this but otherwise a machine rookie Wait, what? Did I just hear Sharon laughing at me? Even back then when we almost first got together, she was laughing at me already. This was serious stuff. I mean, I was pretty stressed out about being stuck in this tractor because I didn't have any other machines and no other experience. <laughs> 